Welcome to my channel. Today we're going to learn about a Thai nursery rhyme. The title is Chang. Okay, I'm pretty sure that you must have heard this song before. Chang means elephant. Okay, Chang is high tone. Chang. If you want to hear me sing and play a piano for this song, stay tuned to the end. Let's just start with the first sentence. Chang, 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 Chang. So Chang five times, right? Elephant, elephant, elephant. Say that five times. Nong Kei Hin Chang Rupao. Nong is a pronoun that we use to address younger people. It could be an adult addressing a kid, or it could be someone who's a little older addressing the younger. Kei Hin. The word Kei indicates present perfect in Thai. Hin is to see, so it means have you seen. Chang elephant, right? Rupao, rupao means or not. So together it means Nong, have you seen an elephant before? Now it's time to sing with me. Chang 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 chang, Nong khai hen chang rupao. Chang man tua to mai bao. Chang is uh, elephant. Man is a pronoun that we use to refer to uh, animals or items. And here, I think the composer used it to emphasize, um, you know, the word Chang. Chang man, tua to, tua body, to means big. Okay, to also means to grow up, but in this context, it means big. To and yai means the same thing. Yai also means big. Mai bao, mai bao, mai is no, right? Bao is light, so mai bao is not light. It means heavy. Mai bao can also be a slang or idiomatic Thai. It has both negative and positive connotations. The negative one is uh, used to describe someone who is a handful, and you shouldn't mess with the person, or you shouldn't underestimate what he or she is capable of. And the other meaning, which is positive, is used to describe someone who is extraordinary or special. Chang man tua to me bao. Jamu yao yao. Okay, jamu is a nose. Jamu, both low tone. Jamu yao 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 means long. So yao yao means very long. So Thais tend to do the repetitions of um, adjectives a lot, just to emphasize the word. Riak wa nguang. Riak wa means to be called. So here it is called. Nguang, nguang, ng sound, ng sound, ngong ngu sound, nguang, nguang, okay? Nguang means a uh, trunk. So together, jamu yao yao riak wa nguang, jamu yao yao riak wa nguang. The long nose is called a trunk. Jamu yao yao riak wa nguang, mi kiao tai nguang. Riak wa nga mi kiao okay mi is to have kiao is a tusk tai nguang tai is under nguang okay trunk riak wa is called nga nga okay again ngong wu sao nga 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 okay nga means ivory nga means ivory mi kiao tai nguang riak wa nga Mi hu mi ta hang yao. Okay, mi hu hu is ears. Mi ta ta is eyes. Mi hang no hang yao. Okay, hang yao so long tail. Hang means tail. Yao means long. Mi hu mi ta hang yao. Um, so it has, you know. Ears and eyes and a long tail. Okay, so together this nursery rhyme depicts the shape of an elephant in Thai. That it has ears, a long nose, it has tusks, it has a long tail, it has I don't know so many things. Eyes, basically just you know describe the body parts of an elephant. 
I hope you enjoyed this translation of mine and don't go away just yet because coming right up is my performance for this song and you can sing along as well. Chang 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 Nong khai hen chang rup lao Chang man tu to mai bao Chimuk yao ya 